But shit, hold my own, I own my dick Go Shaloma, unpredictable And roll with the clicker for with big clips I know I'm finna elevated when I came in and be claiming this is I don't care about being famous and shit Hey you, don't click off this video Okay, you just did it anyway Okay, well, um, if you haven't if you haven't, thank you, thank you. And and if you're thinking about doing it, don't click off yet. I just wanted to tell you that the audio in this gameplay is kind of bad. Well, not the game itself, but my voice. It sounded like I put a sock over my mic and started like whispering to it. No, no, that's not the case. Anyways, just hear me out. Hear me out, my guy. I'm gonna be telling y'all that this channel is about to have podcasts and high IQ discussions because my channel is called i chris for a damn reason with the iq in front because me and my people got fucking high iq the most smartest people on earth you feel me you dig you get it get jiggy with it if you enjoy the content please like leave a like and subscribe and i'll be bringing you more i'm gonna be doing my best to do whatever i can you feel me it used to be a military base well, it used to be a ranching thing, then it was turned into an army thing, then it became a bird thing and a museum or whatever. Henry Fonda stationed here, I think, for a bit. Unless he was Navy. Who's Henry Fonda? Around Christmas time, this little breakfast place used to sell these amazing polar bear sugar cookies. Man, those were good. And then one year they changed the formula or whatever and ruined it. Alex? Hey, still with us? You haven't said anything for like uh, 10 minutes. Uh, Mission control to Alex. Yeah. Um, Rada, what the fuck he said? <laughs> so you all moved in? Um, not, not really. I just got in this morning. And how did her mom meet your dad exactly? <laughs> they met on vacation in Orlando. He got lost in a, you know, actually, I'm not even going to tell this story. It's really not worth it. <laughs> Okay. No, wait, what happened? happened? I feel like I haven't heard this. He got lost in some gardens and he thought she worked there and blah, 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 they hit it off. Aw, that's downright adorable. And you guys just met tonight? Yeah, I was, um, I'd been out of school and the timing had just never worked out, so. And what does that make you to her then? Hey, uh, second cousin? Uh... I don't know how people met. He's my stepbrother. Step oh, yeah. yeah. I forgot that was even a thing. Well, at least you seem cool, right? Cool guy, cool hat. You get a cool new sibling living right in your house. Sharing your toothbrush. Wearing your clothes. Eating your food. Smelling up your bathroom. I, uh, have my own tooth. Yeah, sure, whatever. I have someone to reach the food on the top shelf now. Yeah. <laughs> Just happy to be on the team. This is so fun. So, how do you two know each other? Oh, from way back when, like Paleozoic, grade school era. Young enough that I've seen her in a bathtub and it wasn't sexual at all. I mean, we both looked like little skinned potato blocks. All right. <laughs> ah, Ren, why are you even talking about this? <laughs> it's humorous, right? It's just interesting. I think it's interesting. Check under your seat to make sure you don't leave behind any grandchildren. Oh, oh, we should get a quick picture. All of us. This will be like the before shot. They're on their way. Uh, Alright, fine. fine. Let's get just it. Just hold the camera out. Slick it up, dog. I don't look my freshest right now. It's true, Jonas. This is like B minus Alex. Just for your uh, calibration. And it's Jonas? Not Jonah? Yeah, Jonas. Like Jonas Salk? Right, patient zero, AIDS guy. It's Biblical, right? It's, um, biblical, right? Or is that the lion guy? I think every name's biblical, so probably. <laughs> Here's good. Okay. W. Come on, Alex, join the oh, fun. Oh, snap, this is how I move? All right, then. We, uh, need a girl in the picture, Alex? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pause it. There, great. I'll magic erase all the warts out and stuff, so don't worry. All right. Hey, Alex, you brought the radio, right? The little um, portable one? Uh, what radio? That little, you know, the little, it almost looks like a toy. The, uh, oh, oh, you're joking. Just bring it out, will you? Um, shift? 
Okay. There's the little guy. Our high school has a radio station, and Carly, she's a friend of ours. So she's filling in because Reggie got mono from some track runner or something. It doesn't matter. What matters is that she's going to say something like, basically, right now, about our thing. So tune it to 88.3 so I can tell her we heard it. Which I played because that song's been stuck in my head since I woke up this morning. But, oh, oh, actually, it's a little after 10 o'clock, which means my dear friend Ren and his buddies are probably just touching down on Edwards Island for the yearly bash on the beach or whatever we call it now. But anyways, I promised him that I'd play a song from his band, so hope you're listening, Ren. Here are the red-headed bedwetters with baby carrots. I'm be so <laughs> That's I'm awesome. awesome. I hope Christina, with her talent show judge face, was listening. Okay. This man talks a lot, bro. Like, I can't even say We must be face. getting close. There's no radio reception on the island. I'm glad I got to hear it before it went totally kaput. If we can't use it, why'd you bring it? Not just for the boat. Um, no. You'll see. I don't expect too much, but nah, it'll be fun. I won't undercook it. You'll see. Okay. That's what he looks like. I'm right there on the left. Ah, I got green hair. It's like real life at one point. Ah, don't at me. Don't at me. <laughs> Smell that clean air, boys and girls. Boy and girl. This ain't city living. Yeah, um, anybody need a smoke? I have a full pack. Uh, oh, uh, no thanks. I mean, I literally just said the clean air thing, so... Alex, you can bum one off me if you're empty. I forget uh, if you're a fellow addict. Oh, uh, nah, no geez. thanks, I don't smoke. Yeah, Last time I had one, it didn't go well. Yeah, no, I didn't know what coughing with your whole body meant until I saw you dry heaving. <laughs> okay, just checking. Alright, my other friend should be up and around the bed. Actually, that... I mean, I don't mean to be the guy to break us up already, but Ren, can you do me a favor? Can I have like two real quick minutes with Alex for a second? And you can, you know, you can run up and meet your friends. Uh, really? Just... That... Wait, is, is something wrong? What is yeah, it? What happened? Nothing's wrong, nothing's wrong. It'll just take two minutes, super fast. All right, bud. <laughs> uh, look, I, I don't want to go up by myself. I mean, can't we just stick together? You're going to have all night to say, like, whatever. But since you want to meet up with your friends anyway... We're all going to meet up with them. It's like a buddy No, suit. it's... It's fine, Ren. Yeah. Go on up ahead and we'll catch up with you. Yeah, bruh. Um, okay. I guess. Though this is a really strange way to start off, splitting up. It'll be fast. Thanks, man. All I'll right. just be up the hill in case... Whatever. Ren seems nice. He's funny, you know? Reminds me of a guy I know back home. All right, what do you want to talk yeah, about? Put the chit chat. Look, just what did you want to talk to me about before I suspect something nefarious? No, it's nothing. It's not bad. Listen, what? I just wanted to grab you ahead of time and say you've been cool about everything. And I guess it's just for me, I, I, I've never moved anywhere. And like getting a new family at the same time kind of feels like I'm skipping the training wheels. Not that it's been bad or anything. You and your mom have been great. We'll make do. Yeah. Lemons. Lemonade. However that goes. An optimist. Oh, Christ. Oh, my God. Stop oh, it. Stop it. Oh, and thanks for setting up the attic for me. It's cool how it's like a little bedroom. I was in the basement at my old house, so this is an improvement. <sighs> I'll little be, bruh. <laughs> oh, that's wild. I heard, um, I think from my mom that you, uh... Went to jail? Yeah. Yeah, well, don't believe everything you hear. We can catch back up with Ren now. I didn't mean to take so long. Let's go, bro. Let's go. So, I kind of like game because um like you can like there's discussion you feel me it's not just straight gameplay like there's a story and shit and i not really fuck with games with story because that shit intrigues me i think it intrigues everyone bro now where the f Can we go here how do i enter 
Hello, kids. Look, the other guys and gals must be further up, so be quick now. Okay, speed read definition of Edwards Island. This is a tourist trap with shops and a beach. Nobody lives here except for some geriatric named Mrs. Adler. But, as God is my witness, we'll never mention her or any other old person's name again. We are here to drink and be stupid, a tradition apparently started by bored recruits in the 1950s who would sneak dates over from the coastal towns. They literally called it trawling. Uh-huh. Wait, how'd they pull that? Isn't, like, security an important thing in military bases? Yes, but apparently the desire to have cheap sex with floozies will overcome all borders. It's the American way. So, to summarize, we are not allowed here after dark, the town is shut down, and we, the Kamina High junior class, have come to commit improper acts. And the other thing is the weirdo caves. Weirdo caves? The whole reason Alex brought her radio is because when you go to the... It's like the front. The mouth. The mouth of this particular cave, you can sometimes okay. pick up frequencies to stations that don't exist. You'll hear voices or just sounds. And they're impo It's, um, it's pretty creepy. At least I've heard. I did it once. It's amazing when it works. So back up a second. Who's Mrs. Adler? Her family, I think, like, owns or owned some of the island or something. She's been shacked in the same spot for like 70 years. She's kind of what you call the local legend. She has a house on the other side of the woods. I can't imagine living in the same exact house, looking at the same exact walls for that long a time. Well, it takes a certain someone. And actually, you know what? Speaking of the opposite of those certain someones... Drum roll, please. Jonas, did you know that a little birdie told me that our Alex here is thinking of going out of state to college? Oh, really? Yeah, so... Don't and did this little birdie tell everyone he did Susie Lyons even though it was only over the pants stuff? Uh... Huh. Just because Mark spends his study hall at the advisory board doesn't mean he's allowed to look through our submissions. Look, Alex, I just... If you are thinking of leaving, I just hope you're doing it for the right reasons. That's all. That's my whole spiel. What's what the hell mean? does that mean? That nothing, exactly? nothing, nothing at all. Do what you want, forget what I said reasons? anything. Thanks so much for bringing me out, you guys. I can tell I'm gonna have a really good time. We, um, we don't normally bicker so much. Yes, normally I just agree with whatever she says. So yeah. this is unusual. You better. Oh, let's go, come on. I'll lead the way. Actually, you guys will lead the way. I can't, I can't move. Oh, yes, I can. Okay. The beaten path officially ends here. The beach is past the fence. I think Jerry told me that there's a way that you used to get over there, but I'm blanking on what it was. But it's not. Oh shit. Uh, so we're here. That's pretty amazing. This this island is pretty big. Now how do I get rid of this shit? <laughs> I mean, it can't be too difficult. Uh. I think the dumpster will get us over if it'll budge. Well, let's try it. Okay, let's go. Why is this man not doing nothing? Like, what? I'm the girl. I should be doing nothing. Um. Before we get there, I should I should probably mention that. <laughs> oh god. Who's that? That's so there's this girl, Nona. Okay. 
she's just this girl, and I'm totally into her, and I want her to be into me, so just, you know, j just be cool, okay? All no right. pouting or complaining or anything, all right? Deal? Ren, I got relax. you. Oh, and okay, Jonas, now that we're dumpster buddies, what was the thing that you said to Alex back there? Do you have one of those vestigial tails or something? Uh, it was nothing, really. Oh, Jonas is just nervous about moving in with a strange girl yeah, in a strange town and so. fitting in and every stupid cliche you can think of. I'm not... It's not what it was, really. I just like to take the time to make proper introductions, that's all. <laughs> uh, okay. I'd probably not have said that because if, um... How the hell? Um... If he wanted to tell me in private, we should have just kept it in private. He didn't want him to know about all that, so. Yeah. Now I feel like a dick. Like, if someone tells you something in private, it's meant to be in private, you don't say it afterwards, then there's no point. So I don't know why I did that, but I just did it, so. Reginald, I hear you over there. Hey, guys. Wait, I was saying, I was about to tell a story. What was it? About Brad's car? Oh, well, that can wait. Are you coming, my guy? Hey. We started a fire down the way, but Nona wanted to play beach nanny, so... Uh, yeah. Hi. Hi. And Jonas, that's... Who are you? Jonas. That's Jonas. He's Alex's new in town, fresh as the daisy stepbrother. Stepbrother? Really? Yeah, I know. It's a trip, right? Uh, yeah, this is his first night here, so everybody be on your best behavior. Treat him you. as you would a scary dog. Palms out. <laughs> That's, um, I don't bite. It's fine. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. You're Jonas. Jonas, the stepbrother. Yeah. Um, what's your name again? That is Clarissa. How but are she's... you her stepbrother? Like, what does that even mean? Um, uh, her mom is marrying my dad, so, you know. Mm. Exactly. Yeah, well, I guess this is happening now. This is a thing that is happening, so... <sighs> Where's everyone else? Nicole had that tennis thing. And? Clarissa, we... <laughs> we took the last ferry. I thought more would show up, but... <laughs> oh my god, it's just Alex and her new stepbrother? Huh, <laughs> that's it. That's who you brought. That's the group. Ugh, come on, Clarissa. I'm fun. I'm hip. I'm with it. Listen exactly. to yourself. Wait, aren't you all, like, friends? I'm friends saying. with Nona, and I'm downgrading Ren to, like, a creepy neighbor. And you, I just met. <laughs> yeah, I'm... Hey, what about me? Well, what about you? Wait, what? So are we not cool? Yo, let me find out that... Who brings her off to the same island? Like, what? What kind of shit is this? Everyone likes me. I'm not a hater. So do I. I probably look you do, but I don't really know. Let's go, bro. Stop being a bitch. Let me go first. Once we get to a checkpoint, I'll end the gameplay. Fire! Man's great equalizer. So, what's the, um, what's the, like, thing to do here? Other than obviously go skinny dipping and get murdered by Jason Kruger. Yeah, I think it's just whatever. We should explore the island. I mean, if this is pretty much a one-time thing, we shouldn't waste it. Hey, where does that old woman live? Oh, you mean Maggie Adler? Yeah. yeah. Nowhere. She's dead. What? Yep, mm -hmm. killed over three days ago. It was all over the news. Local news, anyway. Oldest living resident. Her family's been moving back and forth on the ferry, getting all of her crap. Hey, yeah. we could go see her house. It must be huge. She was rich as- No, we can't see her house. There's a giant fence, and I don't want to tear my jeans trying to climb it. And to answer your previous question, Jonas, the thing to do is lay on the beach and drink till you can't remember where you are. And sometimes play truth or slap. Yeah, let's play that. We can inaugurate Jonas. Ease him into the night's festivities. Isn't it a uh, truth or dare? This is better than truth or dare because nobody ends up licking somebody's butthole. 
You get asked a question. You have to tell the truth, but if somebody can prove that you lied, the accuser gets to slap you. It's a good, uh, getting to know somebody game. Uh, how can you prove that somebody lied? Hearsay, so rumor, good. conjecture, the usual. All right, let's just get on with it. Okay, so okay. first, we're I'll gonna- I'll start. Ren. Uh-huh. Come on, fess up. You want to go out with Nona, right? Clarissa! <laughs> Wait, wait, wait! I want to hear his answer. Uh, oh, man. You're good at this. Well, if being good means being kind of mean about it. Look, it's tough to gauge. Uh, something mm -hmm. like... Enough stalling. I know you want to sample the goods. Now no, just face it. I mean, I, I, I like her as a friend, right? Stop. That's... I just like her as a friend. That's... That's all. <gasps> she's cool. She's... Uh, she's just a friend. Uh, oh, yeah, right. Okay. Thank you, Clarissa. This all was right. Great. Let's just move on. Okay, it's Ren's turn, right? He gets to ask somebody something. Alex, Alex, Alex! <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh... I just have to think about which nerve I want to so delicately pinch. Okay, uh, just take it easy, all right? Tis all in good fun. Hey, no partnering up to be pansies. Silence! Okay, Silence. Mary, screw, kill. I can't... Me, Nona, and Clarissa. Why? <laughs> it's fun! It's funny, I don't know. And Jonas is family now, technically. So he's excluded. Well, I'd marry Nona. I like the quiet types. I'm flattered, Thank I you. think. <laughs> okay, you're going down the line. Clarissa, obviously. <laughs> obviously. You're not gonna call her out on that? No, I believe her. I mean, look at me. And wait, That's wait that means you'd kill me? Out of everyone here, your best friend. And I'm the only guy. This is Miss Andrew. Miss Andrew, I said. Okay, settle down. That's tough. You set yourself up. Bro. So Alex's turn. Yep. Yeah. Lady's choice. Alex ask. gets to pick who to ask something of. Oh, great. Here we go. What's your favorite stuffed animal? Professor Snodgrass, the platypus man. Clarissa. Oh boy. Yes, mum. Yeah. This is pretty fun. Just watching. I'll admit. Have a crush on well, him. wait. If someone were to ask you to describe me, what would you say? Wow, bad, 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 bad. really swinging for the fences here. I'd tell them you were an average girl okay. with common thoughts. Jeez, why don't you say what you really think? Actually, well, to be wow. honest, I don't know what I was expecting, so, okay. Clarissa's turn now. <laughs> Alex, you got a new brother, pretty exciting. I'm sure Jonas is excited, or maybe excited isn't the right word. Maybe a little overwhelmed with just everything, you know? Unsure. It's a lot to take in and adjust to. I'm, um, fine with it, really. Well, as fine as you can be anyway, right? I'm just saying what Jonas is already thinking. That statistics show if you get divorced once, you're probably gonna get divorced again. And the fact is, your mom divorced your dad. So, let's put his mind at ease and hear why. I, I don't, I don't really need to know- Clarissa, Jonas is fine. He's not a scared puppy. None of that matters. Exactly, but well, shut that damn mouth. Well, why your parents got a divorce in the first place, and we'll see if it matters. Clarissa, I don't really care why they got a divorce. Just that Alex's mom is happy now. This isn't fair. Like, at all. I went super easy on you when it was my turn. And this is an easy one, too. Why'd your parents get divorced? I know you know why. Uh... All right, you know what? Let's just stop the game, okay? Right, I think bro. everyone's ready to do something else. Think, Wait, let's let's ask. not stop like this. We should. Game's like... over, Ren. I won, and to celebrate, I'm gonna sit on the beach and drink, and maybe if I'm feeling spicy, even take a nap. Maybe we can. And get... that's exactly what Nona's gonna do too. Man, what What's is your problem? problem? Lisa? Just what did we? What did I do to make you act like I ate the last piece of chocolate cake on your flippin' birthday? Nothing, Alex. You did absolutely nothing. Oh, well, right, then, then. Cheese! If you guys in your scavenger hunt or playing Ring Around the Rosy happen to find anything more interesting than a slowly dying starfish, you be sure to just let me know. Super. <laughs> sure, that. we'll grab ya if we find any, um... Island Bigfoots? Island Bigfoots, exactly. Well, I want to inaugurate this bitch by checking out the caves. Nona, want to come? Uh, I mean, I would. I'm very but... clingy, Ren. <sighs> Fine. Jonas, you're a strapping young lad. Help boost me over the fence. The cave's just, uh, yonder. And I guess you expect me to just jump over after? Well, like I said, you're a strapping young lad. 
Okay, come on. Where are you from again? It's a small town near North Valley. Oh yeah, is it nice? If you like bars on the windows. Alright, we're gonna have to end it here. Alex, you wanna check out the caves, or...? Yeah, I'll, I'll check it out after this. Got my rain for umbrella, they throwing shade over. I sip this bottle to the bottom, got a hangover. Paint your face with this chopper, that's a makeover. I still told him that shit that they throw gang over.